I thought I'd tell you a little story. Several years ago, a long time ago, um, doing some youth ministry, I remember going into this one small place where there was a bunch of kids and they had sofas and, and stuff like that. And, and it was like a gathering place for, for teenagers. And I remember going in there and talking to this one particular girl. And of course, you know, bring it around to Jesus Christ and what he did at Calvary to set us free of our sin. The fact that he forgave us and he died, he rose again. This girl was probably about 15 years old and I asked her, I said, you know, what, what do you know about Jesus? And I still remember it very clearly. She told the whole story of Jesus and that he died and, and rose again and that if you believe in your heart that God rose from the dead, you shall be saved. And she said, but wait, 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 get this. When Jesus comes back, she was all excited and animated. And she was, when he comes back, get this. When he comes back, it's like God's got this big vacuum cleaner. And, and, he, and he sees, and he presses the button, and he, and he turns it on. And he says, oh, there's one of mine. Sucks him up into heaven, she says. And she was so excited. And I thought, wow, this girl knows her stuff. I remember, though, at the end of that conversation, I asked her, I said, so is Jesus Christ your personal Lord and Savior? Have you made him Lord? Do you believe all this? She said, no. I just know the story. Folks, there is a lot of people that know the story of Jesus Christ. There's a lot of people that can sound like they're excited about it. And there's a lot of people that don't have Jesus Christ as their personal Savior. They haven't, they haven't solidified the relationship by giving themselves to Him. By changing their ways. That's repentance. Change of heart. Saying enough of my own way. It's time to follow God's way. Putting sin behind and moving into the righteousness of Christ that's in us because of Him. Friends, if you know someone that knows the story, ask them if they've made it real in their own lives. Be blessed today as you go on and move forward for the kingdom of God in this world.